All right, so I'm going to show you how I make my poinsettias. Um, so start with is I'm going to show you what you need. So I have this berries that I got from Hobby Lobby. So I got two different colors. So you can mix, mix and match it with the different kinds of mesh that you have. So I have two kinds. I have the red one and I also have the silver one. And then the next one that you need is a pipe cleaner. <clears throat> so I ordered this from Amazon. It is come it comes with four different colors. So you got green, the silver, yellow, and the red. And I guess it's like somewhere around 20 bucks, but there's like 300 pieces of them, so you have a lot. And then of course you're gonna need a, a glue gun. So I have the this one. So and if you need something thing um like scissors as well so you can cut the mesh and as well as something that you can use to press the mesh when you stick it onto or the pipe cleaner into the mesh so let's go ahead and start so what i'm gonna do first is grab a couple of these so for one poinsettias you need five uh, pipe cleaners so what we're gonna do with the pipe cleaners first is we're gonna make a uh, roll it on form it and form it like a stem so we're gonna roll it out like that and then just press it it should look like that it doesn't have to be perfect as long as you know it's closer to like the form of stem there you go so you're gonna make five of these super easy Just like that. And three. Again, it doesn't have to be perfect. So you don't have to worry. Four. And five. So now what we're going to do is we're going to cut this mesh or open, yeah, cut this mesh and put that one in. So what I do is just cut like a portion of it because it's hard when you leave it in a roll. So I just cut a piece. Oh, sorry. So I just cut this much. And then we're going we're going to put we're going to use the glue gun and put the glue around this stem and then stick it on the mesh. But we're going to make sure we have something to use, like a board in that way. Your glue gun won't stick on your, uh, on your counter. So let's go ahead and try... my glue gun ready so let's go ahead and put the glue like I said around the edge just like that and then we're gonna go ahead and put that one so the idea is you want to make sure that you use every single or you make sure that you fit the whole five in there as many as you can in that way you can make how many pinsetas you have 
So you want to make sure you don't have to like space them out so you can just leave a little space in between so you can cut them easily as well. Another one. Ooh, it's dripping. Just like that. Now you just use this little um, cutter to press the pipe um, cleaner to the mesh because if you use your own, like your finger, it's going to be hot. So be careful. And then on to the third one. Whoops. Just like that. And then just to make sure you kill it off. You can move on to the next one. Okay, so this should be ready to go so now what you're gonna do next is to cut them so you have to trace it so just cut it on the side so it should be look like this so don't worry about like the glue that's sticking out. Uh, trust me, at the beginning I was like worried about it, but I just thought about like maybe just treat it like a, a snow, so you kind of have like a frosty princess. <laughs> just something like that. Okay, and then the second one. So you're just going to cut every single of them. Okay, so now it's all cut. So now you have five of these. So you can form it into like a poinsettias. So now what we're gonna do is we will cut one of these berry. So I guess since it's silver, I'm gonna try to use red color instead of white. But it's up to you actually. But I just wanna, I feel like red would pop up even more than the white. So um, I'm gonna get all the way here. So now we're going to form this into poinsettias. So we're just going to 
bend a little bit. You can either stick it on the middle and later we can secure a glue put a glue in there just to secure that red berries in the middle so you just have to make sure it's like if you possession them you can we can do that like later so it doesn't have to be evenly spread out. You can even overlap them a little bit if you want to. Um, or you, if you want, like put it like each side by side, something like that, you can also do that. But I feel like it's more cute and um, if you overlap them a little bit. It should be look like that. Now, to secure this, is what you can do is use one of these and then just twist it all the way. You can also twist the rest of it, so that way with, when you stick it on your tree, it's very easy. So it should look like that. Now what we're going to do is put the berry in the middle so we can put glue to secure them. Maybe I need to add more glue. <laughs> Just like that. And then you stick the berry in the middle. And be careful, there's glue and it's hot, so... There you go. And there you have it! Oh, you didn't see it. So there you go. That's how you do your poinsettias. I hope you like it um, for me it's like I'm happy with the results so it won't even take you five minutes to do one of these so it's very simple so you just do it as in your own pace and make as many as you want to and here you go